On November 13, 2012, your USF Dons played their first regular season home game against Cal State East Bay. There's freshman Tim Dirksen with a nice three-pointer early, and D.N. Parker made a nice fadeaway as it bounced into the basket. The Dons kept their fans energized throughout the entire game. Cal State East Bay kept the game tight early on to the dismay of Rex Walters. Then Mark Tollefson with one of his two steals there, Cody Doolin led the fast break, and then Tim Dirksen with the quality layup. Avery Holmes continues to be a force off the bench, scoring three of his 13 points. There's Andrew, the male cheerleader, riling up those Dons fans. Cody Doolin then drove to the basket and got fouled. He made his first and second free throws, finishing five for six on the night. Later in the first half, Avery Holmes had the ball and passed it to Dirksen, who after some struggles, made the basket. Nearing the end of the first half, D'End Parker made an excellent three-point shot and was fouled at the same time. This propelled the Dons to a 30-21 halftime lead. The second half was much more explosive, and it started with Doolin passing to Dirksen, who drove to the basket. Then Dirksen got the rebound, and he dribbled past numerous defenders, leading up to an incredible layup. Cole Dickerson contributed with 15 rebounds and 14 points. There's Cody Doolin with the shot off the backboard as he finished with 11 points. Here the Don showed a lot of hard work as Chris Adams got the ball, dribbled to the other side of the court and passed it to D'End Parker who made the three. D'End Parker continued to shine as he made another basket. Cal State East Bay was still keeping the game tight as Jakari Whitfield made the basket. Avery Holmes! With 10 minutes to go, the Dons had a slight lead at 46-43. And here's Cody Doolin setting up Cole Dickerson for the monstrous slam dunk. Although it had Rex Walters saying, What? And another dunk by Mark Tollefson. Dickerson got the ball again late in the half as he was fouled, and he ended up making not one, but two free throws. He made six of ten for the night. The final score of the game was USF 73 and the Cal State East Bay Pioneers 58. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Andrew North.